Hey guys, um, so my name is Skyly, and if you are new here, I'm back with another video, and I think this is my first video. Yeah, I think it is. I don't know. But, um, so, I went birthday shopping today, I got my nails done. I got acrylics on, and I got them painted matte, gray. More like, on camera it's like black, but in real life it's gray. It's like a dark gray. Um, and, so, we, um... Me and my soon-to-be stepsister Maya, we went birthday shopping. Now, she got some stuff. She made a video on it. She's going to be posting that. But, um, I got some stuff. We got into three stores. We went Five Below, Michaels, and Justice. Because she got, um, we each got Justice and, no, Michaels and Five Below gift cards for Christmas. So, we went to them. And then we went to, uh, Justice because we wanted to get some from Justice. So, and then I also got, like, a care package type thing for my, from my mom. Um, her friend gave it to me, so my mom gave me some of the stuff. Her friend gave her a bunch of stuff, so my mom gave me a bunch of the stuff that she, because it was for me and her, so she, like, gave me some of the things that her friend gave us. So, um, let's just get started. The first one we're going to start off with is... Michaels, um, I love Michaels. Michaels is like one of my favorite stores. Um, so the first thing we got at Michaels was <laughs> this snack cup. Now, this snack cup, snack cup, I know it doesn't, it probably looks huge on camera. And this is probably going to be one of the times where people say like, well, it's not really that big in real life. It is big in real life. It is like... It's bigger than my head. Way bigger than my head. I mean, this thing is huge. So, basically, it's... You have a straw here, which is, like, connected to the cup somehow. I don't know. It's, like, connected by this little zip tie. It's weird. You have a straw, and the cup, and the snap cup. You just lift it like this, pop it open. And you put your snacks in there. And then your drink goes in here. And you put it on. And you just like snap it. And now as you can see right here, there's a little opening. I don't know if you guys can see it, but like right there with the straws, there is a little sliver. So you gotta be very careful not to spill it. If you tilt it this way, it's gonna spill. So you gotta be careful. The person that I whenever bought this, the worker, she even said told me to be careful. She got one of these and she spilled it too, she said. So, I gotta be careful with that. Um, but this is a snack cup. It was only five bucks, so like, I had a $15 Michael gift card and this was five bucks. How can you go wrong? It's, um, this holds 45 ounces of liquor, I'm pretty sure. I don't know how many ounces this is, but. Okay, um. Yeah, 45 fluid ounces. For this and 1.3 liters. So it's about, yeah, 45 fluid ounces. The snack holder holds um, 40 fluid ounces. So this hole right here, the cup holds 45 fluid ounces, and the snack, um, little snack cup, holds um, 40 ounces. So it's like, how can you go wrong with a 95 ounce cup? You can't. <laughs> um, but yeah, I love this cup. So, that was one thing I got from Michaels. Um, again, that was 40% off. The next thing I got were two squishies. Oh, oh, poor Lindor. And a Lindor chocolate, um, although it's all crushed up and nasty now. Put that in the freezer. I also got a Lindor chocolate, but now it's melted. Whatever, it's still nice cup. Um, it's like all squished and nasty. So, not nasty. It's just squished and melted. So, I'll just put it in the freezer. Call it Gucci. Um, I also got this little football squishy. It is a... It's a very nice squishy. It was only a buck. It's not that slow rising. But it's not that slow rising. I just loved how soft it was. And, I mean, look. It's decently slow. It's actually, it's pretty fast, it's pretty fastly rising, but I just loved 
the consistency. That the consistency. I love the how soft it was. So it's pretty pretty good. Um, that's that squishy. The next thing we have here we got this, and then and the next thing we got was a, a basketball one. Um, you guys were like, why did you get two of the same type of squishies? Like, what's the point? Well, the point is, is that I like them both, and I didn't know which one I wanted to get. And I know they're boy squishies. People be like, those are boy squishies. Why would you want to get them if you're a girl? Well, let me tell you. I wanted to get them because they were soft. And I like sports, believe it or not. Um, but yeah, they're not slow rising really. But maybe I'll probably just cut a little hole in them at the top so they're a little more slow rising. Let out some more of the air. Yeah, but um... They're so soft, so, like, I don't really care if they're not that slow as Um, I could use all day. Like, so, I got those. I told Maya, look what happened to my Lindor chocolate. It's all I know, what should have in the wine cave? Melted. Did you still eat it? No. Just throw it away? No, I just Hmm? I just Oh. I'm gonna freeze mine and eat it again. And then, in here, I also got some... Um, we'll put the trash in this little bag that I have here. I got a Sephora bag. I didn't go to Sephora. I just got this bag from my mom. Um, I used the trash bag. So, and then I also got this, um, Warheads dropper. I already tasted some of it. It's really good. But, um, but, um, yeah, I tasted some of this. This side is watermelon, this side is blue raspberry. My favorite flavors, so that's why I got it. I love these flavors, and I love sour candies. So, in fact. He's sour. I went to Hardee's. I just got some water. That's all it is. But, um, yeah. Warheads. It was three bucks, but it was on sale for one dollar and twenty cents. So, yes. Um, yeah, that's everything I got from Michael's. I think my favorite out of my Michael's haul would be my snack cup. I love a snack cup. Um, the first store we actually went to was Five Below, but we're not gonna mind that. I actually got only two items from Five Below. Thank you much. Um, the first item I got from Five Below was this Golden Nudes eyeshadow palette. Um, it is pretty, it's pretty big and bulky. I know it is big and bulky, but, um, it's not like that when you open it. It is really amazing. I love this. It was a five buck palette. If we went to Ulta and I got this palette, it'd probably... If there was a palette like this at Ulta, it'd probably be about 10, 15 bucks or Sephora. So, I can go wrong. It's a five dollar palette for what? Um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A sixteen shade palette for only five bucks. That's like better than a good deal. That's like what? Like only like twenty five cents a shade or something like that. I don't know. But it also has a mirror. The mirror's not that big, but it's big enough. Like. I can see my face through it, my whole face through it, so, um, I'm actually going to take this thing off, so it, yeah, it, ha it says not to use, it says cosmetics are not intended for children 14 years of age, underage, do you, mm -hmm. I'm 12, I'm 11 years old, and I use makeup, yeah, I started using makeup when I was like 11, I mean 8, so, 7 probably, 7 years old, so, yeah. There. I was trying to get this thing off of the palette. My fake nails are very hard to do this with. I got it. Got it. Now I got some stuff on the palette. Whatever. It's fine. It'll come off over time. I hope. So, yeah. I just took this off. It was that plastic wrapping that came on it. I don't need that on it because I'm going to use this. Maybe swatch some of the shades for you guys. 
what I really want to swatch is the. I'm gonna swatch three of the shades. I'm gonna swatch this black one, that one, and the light shade. Cause like blacks and whites, you want them to be good, right? This black looks very pigmented. Oh my god, that's a. That is a bomb black shade. That black is very bomb. Let me try it. This is only like two layers of product. That's bomb. This is like a Jeffree Star shade up in here. Um, we'll try another one. The brown's not that pigmented, but it's pretty good. It's a pretty decent brown shade. Now what we're gonna try is the white. Well, it's not really white. It's more like a trans, um, I forgot what it's called, transition shade. I don't know why I forgot the name. It's pretty good. That black I'm really surprised about. It's like, it's like darker than my nail color. Shoot, it's darker than my, that's like the color of my soul. Uh, um, <laughs> no, I nicked it. Crap. I nicked it with my nail. I didn't like that. It also came with this applicator. Boy, I don't use these things. I don't like these applicators. Just because, like, come on. Like, anybody's got time for that. She's a freaking shader brush and crap. I just stick to my normal makeup brushes. I did my eye makeup, actually. You can see today, using my Ulta Beauty palette. It's starting to wear off a little bit, but it's still in pretty good shape. So this is my golden, this is my golden bar palette that I got from Ulta, my golden nude shade. Um, there is one, two, three, four, five matte shades and Well, sorry, guys, I'm counting them. One, two, three, four, five. There's five matte shades and 11. 11. Um, 11 shimmer shades. Um, so, this is a very nice palette. Very nice palette. Um, yeah. This is, I'm going to be using this a while. Definitely can tell you that. Each little thing, there's about 1.2, wait, so there's, I know this is, so all total there's about 28.8 grams of product, I think, I don't know, there's quite a bit of product in here, I just know that, I know there's enough product in here to last you a while, I don't know how thick the pans are or anything, they look pretty good, yeah, I know there's a lot in here i know there's enough in here to last you a while i just love the big and bulkiness of it is that weird like is that weird or no nah? i don't know i just love this palette um so i got it so yeah the next thing i got i'm gonna take my goggles off for this to see today my highlighter on fleek today um i used just a wet and wild and when i got from the shade sorry guys it was a notification on my phone i also got this wet and wild all day wear photo focus setting spray it is like it was five bucks it smells like it's called seal the deal i don't know what the smell is mm. it is like refreshing wakes you up because it's cold it's nice it's just i love that sound too when you take it off it's good to have my own setting spray because I have to use my grandma's because I don't have mine. It's gonna nice, uh, nice to have my own. Um, but yeah, this sticker is way off, so I had to fix it. So it was like over here, girl. Why don't you put a sticker there? I mean, there's a clearly a hole there for it. I'm just weird. So these are my two items I got from Five Below. And yes, I spent ten bucks on them, but who cares? It's makeup. I love makeup. I need makeup in my life. I don't care. So yeah, that was my five below haul. I would throw it like, like, drop the mic, but it's my baby. I'm not doing that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I spent about ten bucks there. I have my receipts. I don't feel like getting them out right now. I was going to tell you guys the prices, but I took them. Um, so the next thing is justice. Oh, you don't want to take out the AC. I spent friggin' uh, 52 bucks. Didn't want to spend 52 bucks, and 
you guys hear noise in the background? That's my dog barking. Sorry about that. This is a coupon I got. Um, fifteen dollars off if you purchase. If you make a purchase of four dollars more, and twenty five dollars off if you make a purchase. Um, seventy five dollars more. So, yeah. Yeah, um, and then there's another one for the in-stores. So there's two of them online and in-stores. It's really nice. But yeah, we got a coupon. I spent about 50 bucks, so yeah. Yeah, what I got at Justice, I'm going to take now. So at Justice, I got these, um, dolphin shorts. What the heck? Oh, these are, it says breath breathability and quick dry. I'm not going to tell you guys my size because then you guys are going to think I'm... You want to take that sticker off and put this sticker in the back? Because my grandma just had to give me this one. Just had to. What is it? Huh? Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. Um, these are my shorts. They look big, but they're really not big. It's just the camera. Um... These are my shorts that I got. I'm not telling you guys in size again because I don't want you guys to think anything of it. These are the dolphin shorts, breathability, and quick dry test. So, that's nice. And they just have this little slit on the side. And they're really nice, like, pattern. Kind of like, see, like, triangles. It's just really cool. It's like marbled, kind of. Um, so, those are my shorts. And then the shirt I got was a crop top. Again, not telling you guys my size. Okay, let me make sure there's no sticker on it that I gotta take off. Okay. We go cheap. We gonna hide that sticker. Um, so yeah, this is just a shirt that says born with it. And it's a no sleeve crop top. I know it doesn't look like crop top, but it is a crop top. Um, that's what I got from it. It just says born with it. It has justice and silver on the side of it, and it's just a gray color. So it's like a a, a purpley gray, but it's more of a gray. <laughs> Car, um, so <laughs> yeah, that is my justice haul. Skadoosh! Now we are going on to the goodies. This is some stuff that my mom gave me. Oh, first of all, I think out of all the stores we went to, my favorite haul would be maybe I don't know. The one I spent the least at definitely was, um, definitely, definitely was. Uh, five below. So that may be my favorite one just because I sent the least, but. Wait, is that mine or yours? Mine. Oh no, that Menards bag was mine. No. Did it. Those are my clothes in there. Did it have Pez in it? No. Oh, okay. Sorry, I got confused. Um. No, it was trouble, my sister. Um, so now this bag is my bag from my mom. This is from my mom. Um. I love this bag so much. Like, oh, oh crap, oh crap. Like, we need to get a breather. Real quick. Um, sorry, puppy, but I'm gonna use you to clean off my table real quick. <sighs> sorry about that. Um, but so we're gonna get to this bag. So the first thing we pull out in this bag. Is a makeup bag. Um, this is a makeup bag. It's a really pretty makeup bag. I'm probably just gonna use this for like my on the go makeup, like what I'm gonna use when I'm traveling and crap. Cause we don't want to. I have a big makeup bag about this big, filled with makeup, and it's so like it is not convenient at all to travel with. So this will be nice just to slip in some of my products. Um, oops. Ooh, this is like, um, this is one of the Ipsy Glam bags or whatever. See, like, every month you do an Ipsy prescription and they send you some crap. Um, this would be, this is what that bag was from. But it's a nice bag, so I got it. Um, just has this little tie here, too, on the side. Just this little tie right here. Nothing too, too out there. Just a little simple big bag. Um, the next thing in here is these foundation and concealer samples. Now, honestly, 
I don't want to support this foundation or this concealer because look at this. Okay, guys. So look at the results. Of course, that's real, all nasty, and that's the results. But look at the shade range. This is their lightest shade. That's the darkest shade. There's not even shades in between. I, I just feel like that's a disrespect to colored women because, like, they don't have their shade. I don't feel that's right. Like, so I'm not colored, so I have my shade. I just don't think it's right that colored women going to last. Shout out to Jeffree Star and James Charles for that one. Because it's true. But I don't think colored ones are going to last. Um, but anyways, this claims that seven products in one. Full coverage foundation, SPF 50 plus, FPS 50 plus, plus, like SPF 50 plus. Physical only sunscreen. Brightening color corrector. Anti-aging serum. Porm minimizing porm porm pore minimizing primer, dark spot corrector, and moisturizing day cream. Oh, I guess that is pretty. I don't understand how this could be a primer and a foundation. Is it just me? It's just me or something. But yeah, so this is the little sample here. I mean, I'm gonna use it. It's only like a one-time sample. Maybe two times, three times if you're lucky. Um, but I just don't support having only five shade ranges and not having enough for like dark, dark skin tones. Like, really, you got almond, but you don't got. I don't know. It's just. I got shade medium. I mean, she didn't know, but it looks like a match my skin. Pretty Gucci. So, the next one here is the it bye bye under eye the it cosmetics bye bye under eye cream now again these shade ranges come on these have even less shades light medium tan and deep what the heck is that about like that that no two of the shades are the same what's the difference between light and medium there is none boom like, this is just wrong. It covers everything. It covers everything. Yeah, it does cover everything. But a good shade range. Because there is not a good shade range for neither one of these. I don't know. Ooh, it just makes me mad. Um, this is a full coverage anti-aging waterproof concealer. So, again, I'll give it a try, but... I still don't think it's right, the shade range they got. Like, come on, man. You're making a lot of noise back there. Um, that's my sister's friend background. Sorry for the background noise, guys. But, I don't know, this is wrong with me. Like, the shade range, I love this. I love makeup, but like, I don't know. The shade range is just impactful. The next thing I got here is a charcoal mask. Purifying black charcoal mask. It is hydration, moisture, moisture. It's green tea extract, green caviar extract, 15 to 20 minutes of relaxation, and some some crap. Bench, 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 charcoal black fiber sheet. So it's basically just a sheet mask. Um, you leave it on for 15, 20. You wash your face before. You leave it on for. You put the mask on. You leave it on for 15, 20 minutes. Take it off. Skin rejuvenated. Whoop -de -de. Yeah, I know how these work. I do them a lot. Um, but yeah, I love face masks, so that's really good. I love face masks. The next things here are these little Ulta Beauty palettes. Um, this one I think is the yeah. This one is the face palette. So it comes with like a bake shade, you know, like bake contour, nose, under eye. Basically, everywhere you put your concealer, you bake. Um, right there. Then there is a warm. Oh, it's like, no, it's not that thing. Dude. But who cares? I can just build it. I know these palettes are very buildable. Um, so, because like, my grandma has one, like this one, and it's buildable. So I'll use that. This is a warm. Ooh, ooh, that's pretty. Um, I don't know if you guys pick it up on the camera. But it, it looks very light, but once you put it on the face, it's better. And then this is a radiant diamond. 
Oh my god, that is pretty. Radiant diamond, that's what it's called. I don't know if you guys can see it. The sun. You guys probably can see it right there. I don't know. It's just very pretty. On camera it looks white, but on the thing it is, um so you got your transition, transluctant, transluctant, translu translucent, translucent set blah. Translucent setting powder, radiant diamond highlighter, and warm bronzer. So, that's pretty nice to have. The next thing here is an eyeshadow palette. Again, with these doe foot applicators. Why do I say doe foot? I don't know. I just don't use these things. I feel like it's a waste of time, but like, I don't know. I just don't use them. So, here we have two shimmer shades and four matte shades. So, the first one is Sunshine. I love it when they have the names under the palettes. That's like one thing I love about Ulta Beauty. Love it. Um, Sunshine. Plum Drop. Say What. I mean, Desire. Sorry. Oh, I nicked it with my finger. Crap, I hate that. Desire. Say What. Buzzword. And here is Fearless. I love this color. Desire, I think, should be swatched. It's, it, I mean, that shade's a little scary, but you can't really judge a book by its cover. You gotta see what it looks like on the outside. What? You can't judge an eyeshadow by the way it, you can't judge an eyeshadow by the way it swatches. You have to wait till you see what it looks like on your eyes. The next thing here is this How To Bronze Physicians Formula Bronzer. Um... You actually opened it up, and... Ooh, I'm gonna nick this one, too. Crap, I hate this. I nicked it, too. Um, How to Bronze is actually a very pretty color. There's a dark shade and then a light shade there. And then you close it up, and you open it. You push your hands here, and you grab it, and it comes with a brush, which is, like, angled, so it's, like, perfect for your cheekbones. And it comes with a mirror. And then it comes with the way to bronze. It says to sweep brush over dark shade and blend two shades together. Like there's a dark shade. You sweep brush over this dark shade or blend the two shades together. And sweep across forehead, brush down into cheek and finish along jawline. Like a three, basically, is what it's telling you. Um. And use light shade to highlight and even out. So basically, you do that and you kind of highlight it under there, highlight it in your nose, under eyes, stuff. Basically, pretty simple. Um, here, here, everywhere you would normally, I guess, put concealer. I guess. So this is the, as you can see right here, it's in the shape of a three. Um, because that's what you gotta do it. Here is the light shade. Here is the dark shade. Oh, well, it's not really that dark. But, and it's pretty. I love the packaging. I forgot to brush away. I love the packaging of it. It feels very classy. Um, but anyways, so the next thing here is this Marc Jacobs. It's not Marc Jacobs. Tom Ford Black Orchid um, Perfume. And this is actually, like I said, a Tom Ford. So I'm probably going to end up giving this to my dad. Um, just a little sample. Yeah, this is definitely, ooh, it smells like, I don't know, it smells like florally almost, which it is black orchid. I don't know, I don't know if that's a man scent really. I don't know, um, but it does smell good. So, yeah, this is some hairspray, which I would put in now, but I got this bandana, so I'm not going to do it. This is big, sexy hair, get layered. Okay, um, so it says get layered, um, big sexy hair, I don't know how I feel about that, it's just like a, a metal can, it's very pretty, um, yeah, you just, it's flash dry thickening hairspray, you have this, okay, it's not open yet, sorry, you see, you have these three shelves, okay, just these three, I love the way it smells. Um, wait, which selves? I 
Uh uh. And if you go to the biggest shelves down there. Okay. Um. This is dry shampoo, and the scent. I don't know what scent this is. Clean freak. Clean freak. I don't know. It, it smells pretty good, I guess. This is dry shampoo. Not your mother's. Although it was my mother's. Um, It's just a refreshing dry shampoo. So, pretty nice. So, you just take it vigorously. I um, <laughs> But, um, so yeah, that's a dry shampoo. The next thing in here was this velvet sugar shimmer balm. I love this. It's just like a shimmer lotion. It smells amazing. It's like it's like fruity floral floral florally smelling. It's really good smelling. Yeah. A plus on this one. Um the next thing here bada -bam, bada -bam, is this thing. This is a number 400 Sephora Rogue cream. Lipstick. It's so, so pretty. Um, this shade. If you guys could see this crap on camera. Oh, my way. You know what? I'm even going to put them on now. Because I love to say too much. Take my palette. Shout out to Fabi Love. Um this is the lipstick on. Looks. Mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. No to the I'll to the no, no, no. I don't need to let this go. Don't need to let this go. Cause, cause it looks, looks so stunning. Mm, this is fun. <laughs> this lipstick looks. Stunning. This lipstick looks stunning. I don't have any other words to say, but stunning, amazing, extraordinary, gorgeous, beautiful on, beautiful, beautiful on me. Three words. I don't know. I just, I just love it. Um, next thing here is this Beauty Blender by the brand Something Glam. Um, Um, smish, I don't know, smishing glam or something like that. I don't know, something weird like that. Of course, I opened the one thing I gotta open my teeth as soon as I put on lipstick. This beauty blender feels and looks pretty. I said feels pretty and looks pretty. That's weird. It feels very soft. Um, it's not too dense. Like, I haven't even put on the thing. And it's not dense. It's going to be very good for the under eyes. Um, really good in there. Yeah. I feel like, honestly, I could clean up some of my oil with this, too. This Beauty Blender looks so cute. Feels good. Smells good. Um, a plus on this one as well. <laughs> this is good. I like that. Um, the next thing in here is one of these little hair tie things. It's just one of the little, I don't know what it's called, um, the little hair tie things. Um, but yeah, that's pretty handy too to have. Just to keep, I mean, you can switch it out. Here's it right back in the shape. It's got to do. So I'm going to actually wear this because it looks cute and I like it. 
But, um, yeah. See, the next thing here. I like to tell you guys, some of this stuff has not even been opened yet. There. I can't use my nails to open it because I don't want to break my nails. Um, but, yeah. So, this is a duo eyeliner. Um, it has black and purple. It's called Blackout and Plum. Yeah, Blackout and Plum. I got, I got an eyeliner called, named Majestic in one of the Ulta things I got before. Because I got Ulta box for Christmas. Now, half the products in it are like my tried and true products. But, <laughs> um, it's amazing. It really truly is. It works like a babe. It's stunning. The box is stunning. Um, the products in the box are stunning. I don't know. It's just, it's just really good. Really good. Gene. I mean, shoot. Yes, for me, honey. Yes. Yes, on the muy part. Um, muy importante. But this is the eyeliner. Um, two shades, plum and blackout. Looks very Gucci. So we're gonna be trying that in a ne near video. I can do eyeliner. The next thing is shimmer glow. Sheer Glow Mana Mana Shimmer Lotion. It's just, you can put it on under your foundation and then put your foundation on, like use it as a primer. You can mix it with your foundation. Just use it for a bunch of random things, really. It's a really good thing. Um, the next thing here is this, like, I don't know, this, like, mousse type thing or something. I don't know. This is weird. I don't know how to use this, but it's never been used. Clean as a bean. Clean as a bean. Clean as a bean when it's green. Hey, clean as a bean when it's green. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, but yeah. So let's have a That's good. Now this next thing I'm really intrigued by. This is a lip stain in the shade Salmon. Salmon. I don't know. Aurora. It's literally a marker. Like, look at this crap, guys. It's a marker. Like Okay, I'll write my name. Guys, it's a marker. But it's a lip stain. I don't know. I'm so intrigued by this. I don't know. I thought this was an eyeliner or something. Um lip liner or something. No, I'm intrigued by this. This is this is good. Um the next thing here is like this bath the square bath bomb. From the body shop. It is Vanilla Delight. Um, I actually got one of these. My mom gave me one of these for Maya. My sister soon to be. And one of them for me. That's why this one says you on it. But it's really nice. Um, it smells very nice. It smells like sweet and vanilla -y, Which it's vanilla. It better smell like vanilla. Vanilla Delight. It better smell like vanilla. Um, the next thing here is this Glossier, um, mint, it's this mint, uh, scented balm, it's balm.com, balm.com, I don't know what that is, but it's like a, a mint balm, it's universal skin salve, I don't know, but like, I have this dry spot on my heel right here, like, looking like eczema or some shit, my mom has to check my heel, I don't know, some crap, so, um, Right here, it's like, I don't know what it is, but it hurts. And it's dry. And so my mom gave me this for it. So, yeah, she wrote what it was for. Um, This is really nice bomb. I like it. I have not used it yet, but I'm encouraged. It's never been used yet. So, that's good. I'm excited to try it. Especially for this, right now. I don't know why. Lather myself up with it. <laughs> This next thing is INT Cosmetics, Int Cosmetics, Go Goddess Gold, why don't you say Gold Goddess, um, 
It's so pretty. Like, look at this crap. Boys, this could be used as a, um, a whatchamacallit, like, what? Watch this. This could be used, if you can see that. Crap. I can't really show it to you. I did it in a very bad place. Here, let me just watch it right here. Like, that could be used as a highlighter. It's stunning. Gorgeous. Um, how's that? Next thing. Well, this is a 40 minute video so far, so. The next thing is this NYX blush. Really good. Um, Dusty Rose. Yeah, NYX blush, Dusty Rose. Um, again, I want to dust a little bit of that on my cheeks with my beauty blender. I know it's weird to put product on the beauty blender, but I don't care. Test it out. Yeah, just a little bit of that cheeks. It looks Gucci. Um, I look like Little Red Riding Hood with my little bandana on. I look weird, but I love this thing. Um, the next thing is this BB Don't Blow It. Fine hairstyle. It's like a hair cream, basically. Um, but yeah. So, um, yeah. The next thing here is not that fun. It's just a little, um, lip crayon sharpener type thing. Just a little bit. Not lip. Makeup sharpener. Basically. Um, the next thing here is this D -Jar Dr. Jart Plus Premium BB Bee Balm. It's just skincare. 